welcome students dear students we are in exercise 4.2 in the previous period we have solved the first main question under exercise 4.2 now let us come to solve main second main question number 2 read the first question read the given question give first the step you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation first one number a 3l is equals to 42 3l is equals to 42 3l means 3 into l is equals to 42 to cancel this 3 3 is multiplied with l so to cancel this 3 we need to divide by 3 so don't divide by 3 only on left hand side to balance the equation we have to divide by 3 on both the sides dividing both sides by 3 we get left hand side 3 into l right hand side 42 both the sides divide by 3 3 three cancel in the left hand side remaining l only on the right hand side there is 42 divided by 3 cut by 3 31 are 3 314 are 3 1 are 3 remaining 1 then it is 12 3 4 are 12 the value of l is equals to 14 next question number b b upon 2 is equals to 6 this is left hand side this is right hand side on the left hand side there is the denominator 2 to cancel this denominator 2 we need to multiply we have to, we should multiply the left hand side and both the side and right hand side by 2 so when we multiply the left hand side by 2 <coughs> this denominator 2 cancelled with the multiply with the multiplied number 2 therefore multiplying both side by 2 therefore left hand side is b by 2 and right hand right hand side is 6 multiplying both sides by 2 this two cancelled remaining b only in the left hand side that is equals to 6 to the 12 this is the value of the variable b in this given equation next question c p upon 7 is equals to 4 left hand side is p by 7 right hand side is 4 to cancel 7 we have to multiply both side by 7 multiply multiply both side by 7 we get left hand side is p by 7 into 7 right hand side is 4 into 7 this is 7 cancelled remaining p is equals to 4 7 za 28 this is the value of the variable p next question number d question number d 4x is equals to 25 left hand side is 4x right hand side is 25 4x is written as 4 into x is equals to 25 multiplying both sides by 4 because there is 4 multiplied with x to cancel this 4 we should we should multi we should divide by 4 dividing both side by 4 left hand side 4 into x divided by 4 is equals to right hand side it is 25 divided by 4 this 4 cancelled therefore x is equals to 25 divided by 4 this is improper fraction you can convert this improper fraction to <coughs> mixed fraction therefore x is equals to dividing 25 by 4 Four six is a twenty four. Remaining one, one by four. Answer is six whole, one by four. Eight y is equal to thirty six. 
to cancel this 8 we should divide by 8 therefore dividing both sides by 8 we get 8y can be written as 8 into y divided by 8 is equal to right hand side it is 36 divided by 8 that is equal to 8 and 8 cancel now we can divide we can cut 36 and 8 by 4 4 2s are 8 4 9s are 36 therefore the value of y is equals to 9 by 2 9 by 2 is nothing but 4 whole 1 by 2 therefore the value of y is equals to 4 whole 1 by 2 or you can write 9 by 2 only next question number f z upon 3 is equals to 5 by 4 variable z is on the left hand side and it is divided by 3 now to cancel this 3 we should multiply with 3 therefore multiplying both side by 3 we get left hand side is z upon 3 multiply this by 3 similarly on the right hand side right hand side is 5 by 4 multiply with 3 now this 3 3 cancel remaining z therefore z is equals to 5 by 4 into 3 take the product of 5 and 3 5 3 is a 15 by 4 therefore z is equals to dividing 15 by 4 4 3 is a 12 z is equals to 3 whole 3 by 4 next question number g1 a upon 5 is equals to 7 upon 15 variable a is on the left hand side it is divided by 5 to cancel this 5 we should multiply with 5 multiplying both sides by 5 left hand side is a by 5 therefore a by 5 multiply by 5 right hand side is 7 by 15 multiply with 5 now this 5 and 5 cancel 5 ones are 5 ones are there is only a in the left hand side on the right hand side this 5 and 15 cut by 5 5 ones are 5 three is are it is 7 upon 3 this is improper fraction you can convert this as mixed fraction by dividing 7 by 3 therefore the value of variable a is equals to 3 2 is a 6 remaining 1 1 upon 3 a is equal to 2 whole 1 by 3 or you can put a is equal to 7 by 3 only next question number h 20t is equals to minus 10 20t this left hand side 20t can be written as 20 into t is equals to minus 10 variable t is on the left hand side it is multiplied with 20 to cancel this 20 we should divide both side by 20 dividing dividing both side by 20 we get 20 into t 20 into t divided by 20 is equals to right hand side it is already minus 10 divided by 20 now 20 20 cancel there is only t in the left hand side on the right hand side 10 ones are 10 twos are it is minus 1 upon 2 the value of the variable t is equals to minus 1 upon 2 main question number 3 main question 3 give the steps you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation number a 3n minus 2 is equal to 46 on the left hand side it is 3n minus 2 first cancel minus 2 to cancel this minus 2 we should add 2 on both the side adding 2 
both the sides left hand side is 3n minus 2 add 2 plus 2 is equals to right hand side is 46 plus 2 this minus 2 and plus 2 get cancelled remaining 3n is equals to take the sum of 46 and 2 46 plus 2 is 48 now 3n to cancel this 3 dividing both side by 3 dividing both side by 3 therefore left hand side is 3n divided by 3 is equal to right hand side 48 divided by 3 3 3 cancel 3 1 are 3 1 are similarly 3 1 are 3 16 are 3 1 are 3 remaining 1 then it is 18 3 6 are 18 therefore the value of variable n is equal to 16 therefore n is equal to 16 this is the value of the variable n next b1 5m plus 7 is equal to 17 to cancel this 7 we should subtract 7 therefore subtracting 7 on both the side therefore left hand side 5m plus 7 subtract minus 7 minus 7 is equal to right hand side it is 17 minus 7 plus 7 and minus 7 cancel remaining 5m therefore 5m is equals to 17 minus 7 is 10 now to cancel this 5 dividing both the side by 5 dividing both side by 5 left hand side is 5m divided by 5 and right hand, right hand side is 10 divided by 5 5 5 cancel 5 1s are 5 1s are similarly 5 1s are 5 2s are left hand side it is m therefore m is equals to on the right hand side there is 2 this is the value of the variable m in this equation question number c 20p upon 3 is equals to 40 20p can be written as 20 into p divided by 3 is equals to 40 now on the left hand side there is 20 into p numerator and denom denominator is 3 to cancel this 3 we should multiply by 3 therefore multiplying both side by 3 we get left hand side is 20 into p upon 3 right as it is 20 into p upon 3 multiplying the left hand side by 3 on the right hand side it is 40 similarly multiply right hand side 40 by 3 now this 3 and this 3 get cancelled 3 ones are 3 ones are remaining term in the left hand side is 20 into p is equals to on the right hand side it is 40 into 3 40 into 3 therefore in the left hand side to cancel this 20 we should divide by 20 therefore dividing dividing both side by 20 we get in the left hand side it is 20 into p right as it is 20 into p divided by 20 on the right hand side it is 40 into 3 divided by 20 because we have to we are dividing both the side by 20 therefore this 20 20 cancel 21 are 21 are similarly 21 are 22 are now 2 into 3 is 6 this is the value of p therefore p is equals to 2 3 is 6 next question d 3p by 10 is equal to 6 the variable p is in the left hand side therefore now first to cancel this denominator 10 multiply both side by 10 therefore multiply multiplying both side by 10 we get write the lhs as it is left hand side it is 3p upon 10 into 10 is equal to right hand side 6 into 10 now this 10 cancel 10 ones are 10 ones are 
what remain in the left hand side 3 p only therefore 3 p is equals to 6 into 10 is 60 therefore 3 p can be written as 3 into p is equals to 60 therefore to cancel this 3 we should divide by 3 dividing dividing both side by 3 we get left hand side it is already 3 into p right as it is 3 into p divided by 3 is equals to 60 upon 3 3 ones are 3 ones are 3 3 cancel there is only p therefore p is equals to 60 upon 3 3 ones are 3 twos are 6 then put 0 this is 20 the value of variable p is 20.